clean. Look at this. So this is from Sandra Shop. Um, this is so, so impressive. I don't even know what to say. I'm like so shook. I was not expecting to get a bedazzled face mask. I am so impressed. I'm going to wear this and I'm going to take a photo for you guys. But, you know, Corona's been a little bit hard and I love the way that she's made, you know, beauty out of it. And it's still going to be challenging, but at least we could try to look chic while we wear it. Right? So pretty. Okay, guys. So I know Corona has made everyone go a little crazy. Um, I don't know how you guys feel. I have cabin fever right now. Um, some of our employees actually started working from home almost a month ago. And um, almost two weeks ago, we sat home about 30% of our workforce. And then this past week, and it looks like we'll be here for a while. We've been home and it hasn't been easy working from home. Some of us have kids. Some of us are struggling just kind of making sure that we are in touch with our teammates. And let's be honest, like it's kind of depressing being home because um, it's not like you can go out. You can't actually go out and talk to people. And we're people. We're made to communicate. And even if you're an introvert, at some point you miss being around people. And this has been tough. One of the things that I've been saying to my team that's been really helpful and I think it's been helping me personally, but also um, a lot of us at Huda Beauty is like planning your day. I feel like sometimes the more time you have, the less you do. So we're chunking. I'm chunking my day. I'm doing three things. I spend okay a day. I'm doing three things. I spend okay. So here are the three things that I have been doing that have been really helpful. I have been planning my day and I separate it into three chunks. I do my creative time in the morning and that like kind of really fuels my soul. And then I do like my like execution, like to do list, um, which really helps me as well. And sometimes I'll do the creative work, or I'll do the execution work. So whatever order you do that in doesn't matter, but then you need to plan some me time. This is time just for you. So, um, cause it's so easy. Like yesterday I ended up realizing that I spent the whole day working, which also isn't good. And at the, at the end of the night, I felt really anxious cause we don't know when we're going back to work. Um, we could be home for a while. And that kind of, that is a little bit scary because you just kind of want to go back to normal. Um, and so spending my day in chunks, planning my day, but also planning my week has been really, really helpful. Um, one of the things I was saying to my team, like spend some time cooking, spend some time doing some of those things that you don't normally get to do. Um, drawing, painting, um, watching friends. Friends has been really helpful. But, you know, but, you know, nobody, there's no like rule book on what to do. I mean, there's no rule book um, to what to do during a pandemic. We've never really come across anything this severe, at least in our time. Like the the closest thing is the Spanish flu in 1918. This is crazy. Um, and I know all of us are watching Contagion, all these scary things. But it's really important to stay calm and to find the silver lining um, in Situation 18. This is crazy. Um, and I know all of us are watching Contagion, all these scary things. But it's really important to stay calm and to find the silver lining um, in situations like this. So try to spend some time with your loved ones. Try to catch up on the things that you haven't been able to do. Do chunk your day and give yourself some type of goals because that will just that that will give you a little bit more of a like system to follow. Um, you know, and I'm wishing everyone a lot of love. And I've heard a lot of people are working. And if I, I feel if you are not able to stay home during a time like this, but you don't feel like it's safe to go out, I feel like you should tell your, your, anyways, I love you guys, stay healthy, stay hygienic as possible, like extra hygienic, um, and, uh, and take care of yourselves, because, um, the better care we take, the more we can kind of stop this from spreading, I love you guys so much, hey yo, dating during corona check, this is how you flirt, this is how you tease, and this is how you make out, <laughs>